hi there welcome to my channel if you are new here you're welcome and kindly hit that subscribe button so that anytime we drop a video or a content you wouldn't miss it thank you once again for showing up today we are going to look at how to leverage on a feature in VS code that will help us create the basic structure of an HTML file the easy way okay so let's get right into business so first of all my visual studio code is already launched so i'm just going to go to file and then i'll create a new file okay this is giving me a notification to select a language so from this pop-up i'm just going to search for html right good now let me try saving this thing on my desktop choose desktop let me just create a new folder and name it HTML boilerplate all right so let me name the file index.html all right okay let me do this I'm just going back to here and then select this particular folder okay now that our folder is open with our HTML file okay all right so the basic structure of an HTML file looks like so first of all you would have to have uh, declare the document type doc type all right then you open an HTML uh, tag which is going to house all of the tags that are provided in HTML. Now you would have to have um, a head tag. Now within the head tag goes um, the title tag where you can say maybe my website. All right. Then some few you could have um, a link. A link tag. Um, you can have a link. Tag uh, favicon like so 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 you can have your meta tags your meta tags goes in here and a whole lot a whole lot okay now outside um, the head tag define your body now within the body that is where you're going to put all the things that are going to be shown on the website this is where it all goes so let me just try and then put okay and let's see h1 element this is my website all right now so this is how basically an html file looks like the basic structure of an html okay the basic structure okay you could have um, a footer as well just type footer and then hit tab oh no that's not what i wanted footer okay yeah so this is the basic structure right now you can see we have to take some time step by step to get up to this point you get it to get to this point now vs code provides us with an easy way to achieve this within a twinkle of an eye right so let's look at how to do that so let me scrap all this let the delete now i'm just going to hold shift okay plus the exclamation key on the keyboard right the exclamation symbol on the keyboard right now with this whilst we are holding we just have to hold and it's going to bring a dialogue you see it is giving us a two um, different option, two different option where you can select from the one, uh, the first one, then the second one. You can see that the first one is indicated Emmet abbreviation. That is what we are going to select. So just select this one, and boom, you can see it has given us what we typed ourselves from scratch. Do you get it? So within a single of an hour, we've been able to achieve this. This is so awesome. Okay, so just like I did H1 element and say this is my website good i good to go so let me try seven this thing with a simulated server and see how the output is yes you can see that good 
all right so thank you for watching and that is it for today please if you haven't subscribed consider hitting the subscribe button okay because i'll be dropping more amazing stuffs you can't afford to miss them until next time peace